Peep, peep, llamas and alpacas. This is Livy, your professor of cupology. And today we are heading to the Big Apple. We saw the trailer and the teasers. And let me tell you, that itself is fantastic advertising. But what if I told you that there is a lot more to that? And I do not mean just a little ad in the magazine or maybe a YouTube ad that we all so love. Bullshit. Let's say it's something a little bigger. Like, I I'm repeating myself right now. Big Apple. Big. What am I gonna talk about? Now, let's shut up and wallop. First of all, someone on my Discord server, which again, I always have a link to it in the description below. Please read the rules and by Discord rules, you must be at least 13 years of age to join. Has sent me a, um, a Instagram, which again, I do not have. If you see someone with an Instagram that's under my name, please report it. It is not me. Of the Cuphead Show advertisement, which happens to be on a billboard in Times Square. Time freaking square. And can we just appreciate that shot of the billboard that is like so clear and it's like it's a huge billboard oh my god i i love it and it's right above a starbucks coffee oh i want starbucks now i can go for a starbucks can someone buy me a starbucks please starbucks well anywho let me get back to the point but this is just a fantastic shot of seeing the cup bros shining in the big apple also known as new york city which i've already said that already but this also proves of how big this show is going to be. This show is a big deal. And if someone says, oh, it's overhyped, well, you don't understand. It is not overhyped. It actually needs to be more hyped. And that's starting with it. And I wish there was a billboard like this in Pittsburgh. Please, Pittsburgh, put this billboard in Pittsburgh somewhere, please. And I'm also begging a local restaurant to put something about the Cuphead show on those signs that you change the letters. I, I want them to say something about the Cuphead show, please. But it's not just from that um, Instagram account. We also got a tweet from Mugman himself, Frank Todaro. What a sweetheart. And this is what he said. Times Square, my hometown. Hard to put all this into words right now 20 well it's less than that now days to go which now it's one oh no now it's 19 it's 19 more days the major countdown starts tomorrow because it's the first day of february and i do know there's something going on on groundhog's day but we'll get to that on groundhog's day but that was from dave watson's um instagram guess who has a billboard in times square that's new york city baby and again that and all the hashtags and oh my goodness this is so amazing and i remember showing this to my mom and she thought that was like the coolest thing she's ever seen in New York City and she's been there twice I think twice and I've only been to New York City once and that was with a choir field trip we went to go see Wicked we went to the Hard Rock Cafe we went to Planet Hollywood and we also went to the NBC studios which I actually got to see Betty White rest in peace but yeah I I actually got to see Betty White so that's really an experience but oh man I freaking love this billboard and again I'm gonna repeat myself and I know I have a tendency to do that and I am very sorry but I'm just overexcited about this. I really hope they have something like this for Pittsburgh too, because also Pittsburgh is the home of the very first cup tuber. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. So I think they should have something like that for Pittsburgh as well. I don't know where in Pittsburgh, but we need something for that with Pittsburgh. I think a lot of my Pittsburghese viewers agree with me. The Yinzers, the cup Yinzers. Okay, this is major. But again, tell me in the comment section below what you believe about this billboard is gonna bring up like again this is proof that the show is going to be big it's going to be big and even my mom had said she believes like i've said earlier she believes this is going to be one of the most successful shows not just on netflix she actually said of all time wow and the random question for today is and i think a lot of yinzer viewers will understand this what do you think the cup bros especially cuphead will think of permani brothers what do you think they would think of Pernani? Annie Brothers, and if you don't know what that is, just simply Google it. <laughs> but that is home of the Pittsburgh sandwich, which actually has french fries in it. Also, subscribe and parry the bell so you never miss your daily dose of cupology. And all my social medias are down below, and also the Discord server is right there. And I will see you next time. Knock out the lovo. <laughs>